Hey guys, uh, what you're about to see is a video that I recorded uh, over half a year ago. Um, might have been October, possibly November, but it was definitely the fall of 2017. Um, it's the final and fourth, well, I don't want to say final, it may happen again, but the fourth installment in the first series collaboration between myself and Calvin Saxton. Uh, the other three videos I uploaded last fall within a few weeks after they were recorded, but um, this one, after I suddenly quit YouTube, I just stopped caring about uploading the videos that I already had, so I had a couple few left. Um, and this is the one, the, like I said, the final one. Uh, so check out this video, like I said, um, it was recorded, you know, over half a year ago, last fall. So, uh, a little out of date, but, um, kind of short too, but it's a good video, and, um, make sure you check out, uh, Calvin Saxon's channel too, if, well, even if he's not still making videos, if his channel's still up, which I think it is, uh, you may want to check out his channel too. I'll put the link down below if I remember. Okay, enjoy the video. started oh let's sit. it's good okay. go ahead um, um, um okay so let's see this is a w we're at the natchog state forest we're at beaver dam marsh and uh, a fellow did we he said he caught two bass up here but you know how fishermen are with those fishing stories you know i <laughs> bet it was this big or this this big this big yeah a fish this big <laughs> right here right but i've been here and i have seen snakes and deer uh -huh. and, and, and ducks and geese and wild turkeys and I, I maybe beaver I don't remember um, um, anyway so. oh wow this is a really old looking dam yeah as I say it's from the 30s okay and I thought it'd be worth your seeing oh I thought it looks even older than that I guess because it's, a, it's a country it dam well, you know, it's not much of a dam if the water gets over the sides. I wonder what the point of the sides being lower is. Um, so that some, so that if some of the water is going, and but they still have a marsh up here for wildlife. Okay. The beaver and and the wild birds. Yeah, I've seen like what, like I don't know, herons or loons or mm -hmm. you know. I don't remember right now. Mm -hmm. um, uh, uh, who am I? Where am I? Uh, <laughs> uh, um, anyway, yeah, th this I, I know. Beaver Dam Marsh, beautiful place. Um, Connecticut has a lot of great. It's very nice yep. and peak foliage. You can see that that the gypsy moths stripped a lot of those trees. Look at all them bare trees. They no foliage. Yeah. That's gypsy moth stuff. Yeah, when I was, like I was telling Calvin earlier, I just assumed it was... Slap their face. Well, the, the gypsy moths? Yeah. Yeah. Write a letter to their mother. Tell them, tell on them. Well, supposedly next year isn't going to be as bad because a lot of the moisture from this past year killed off a lot of them. Oh, good. So... I'm all for killing them all. Yeah. The water is so placid over there, though. I really like that. It's pretty. Yeah, yeah, this, this, this is a lovely spot. Yeah. Oops, sorry. It's right. Standing right in front of you there. That's all right. Um, yeah, some nice uh, color in here where the sun's reflecting on the yellow. Indeed. Yellow. Uh, so, which town did you say we're in on for this one? I think we're still in Chaplin. Chaplin. Because the okay. Natchog covers Hampton, Chaplin, and Eastford. Okay. And we're going up by Eastford. Right. In fact, we're going up by the by General Lyons. Uh, okay. Uh, 
uh, birthplace and, and place he died. And the place we were just at is also Joplin? Yeah, yeah. And, and then, and, and then that the that place before Joplin. that, that was, that was Hampton, right? Yeah. Okay. You got a Canon too. Oh, this uh, this is the ca the camera that Calvin uses for his videos. Yes. And, and uh, yeah. The making of the making of. <laughs> uh. Very nice. Um, yeah, this is a lovely spot to, to see and and hike around at, or you know, come out. And... This I meant to come up here and maybe catch some of the meteor showers. See, because one thing about Eastern Connecticut. It's the last dark spot on the overhead nighttime satellite maps. Everything between New York and Boston is lit up. Yeah. Except this, this, <laughs> this, this uh, eastern Connecticut. Because of these state forests we're walking in mm -hmm. right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've noticed that. It, it, uh, it is like the, kind of like the built-up corridor for, between Providence and Boston is kind of, and Worcester is kind of built, built up. And then, you know, there's like the... The cities of Connecticut closer to New York down by the coast, but then in between is Western Rhode Island, Eastern Connecticut is mostly just rural or woodsy. Mm -hmm. It's very neat though, I like it. Now, there is one spot I, I can email you about. It. It's where the, it's the, the swamp where Silver Mine Brook starts. Uh huh. But I've never been able to find out if there ever was a silver mine. And I've oh, been really? up there and I've found nothing. Yeah at the swamp, mm -hmm. the source point for the brook. Sure. So I don't know. Looks like there's a walking trail over there. I'll have to check yeah, that yeah. out another time. Yeah, that's the part of the blue trail, the Nipmuc Trail. Okay. And they, they, they have quite a few walking, horseback riding trails here in sure. the Natchog. Cool. All right, well, I guess that about does it for this video, guys. Make sure, check out Calvin Saxon's channel. And check out D-Rock Rocks' channel. Yeah, they already are. Oh yes, of course. <laughs> Subscribe up there and subscribe to Calvin. Hope you enjoyed the video and this video series. That rocked.